so we're just getting into the start of winter. Things are cooling down. Um, we've been out today in some pretty horrible conditions, you know, southerly winds and full moon. And despite that, we've still managed to catch a lot of fish. And I guess, you know, if you're thinking about hanging up your gear, putting your rods away and your kayak away for winter, think again. Winter's an excellent time to go fishing off the kayaks. And with the right gear, you can have a heck of a lot of fun. Sure, it's colder, but the good thing about winter is things like snapper moving closer, you'll get trevally coming in around the shore, and it's just such a good time to go out there and target fish, especially for kayaks who are really good at targeting shallow water areas. So, you know, things to use over winter. For starters, the clothing is probably the key. I've got sharkskin gear on, you know, sharkskin pants. I've got a sharkskin top. I've got two on today. It's been that cold that I've needed like a sharkskin jacket and a sharkskin climate control underneath. But also, you know, good gloves, um, hat. You know, I've got this around my neck and I can pull it up over my face. And so good clothing, you know, I've got shark skin socks underneath these booties as well. Um, so yeah, it's quite crucial to get the right gear for winter, but when you've got that sorted, you'll be warm and comfortable and then that'll make your fishing experience uh, so much better. So, so much more comfortable. So good, good techniques for winter. Soft baiting, which we're doing here in the shallows at the moment, it's right on the end of the day. You know, like it's quarter to five, We've been out all day, but we've actually just been enjoying some good shallow water action. As that sun goes down, we move into the shallows a bit more. But also, and so a you know, good technique is soft baits up in the shallows using light, light heads like quarter ounce, three eighths of an ounce, and even down to a sixth of an ounce if you're fishing right up into the real, real shallow stuff. Micro jigs are really good over um, winter as well. You know, we've been fishing them today during the middle of the day. They do tend to move out a little bit deeper. So we've been going out as far as 30 metres and looking for fish today. It's been a tricky day. I mean, when, when the wind's in the south, the fish, they shut their mouth. And it's quite true. But despite that, there are still fish out there that will hit your lures if you present them in the right way. So micro jigs are a really good option for winter and soft baits. You know, two things that kayakers do really well. We've been using the sounder today with the micro jigs and dropping down, watching fish come up and hit those, you know, hit those lures. And the soft baits obviously as well. We're just casting them in the shallows, keeping right in touch with them as they sink down and then waiting for them to hit. And striking when there's a bit of a reaction. So it's important to keep an eye on your line because there's some pretty big mooches can be hanging around in the shallows. Other techniques that you can use over winter, mechanical jigging for kingfish. Kingfish can still be on some outer pins. Live baiting's really good as well. Um, especially in where I live in Coromandel, you've got live baits. You've got big, big kingfish hanging around the shore, close into the shore. So sitting on a, a favorite headland and basically with a livey out is a good way to go. Um, even some of the deeper reefs, dropping liveys down on those can be quite productive as well. So yeah, get out there during winter. Don't let winter stop you. I mean, look at the day we've got now. We're just out, the, it's the end of the day and conditions are just perfect for getting out for a couple of hours and enjoying yourself. But the main thing is stay safe out there. Keep warm during winter and you'll enjoy it. But don't hang up your gear. Get out there and enjoy it. Want more information, how-tos and articles on fishing, kayaking and more? Then head on over to the NZ Kayak Fishing Patreon channel and sign up for exclusive content only available through this channel. Oh, what a ripper of a fish it was!